Right. Well, in the menstrual yes. cycle, let's start. And here we start with one of the cycles, the cycle, the menstrual cycle. And um, if I can just get the... the oh, sorry, I always forget <laughs> to give her the right. mask. There you are. If you look at this diagram here, it can be quite confusing. Because here, all of a sudden, you see, where is this? What is this? Those of you who haven't heard of the pituitary gland, it is situated here at the brain, just below the hypothalamus. Net onder kan die hypothalamus, as daar so erkie grote um, klierkie, a verskrikkelike klein kielier, maar wat verskrikkelik by hormone afskyn. Mm. And what we want you to remember too is, just remember, hormones are secreted directly into the blood and that is why they are called and referred to as endocrine glands. So hierdie klierkie sky twee hormone af, at puberty. You see, when, when does it start? At puberty. So, the hypophysis stimulate the pituitary gland then at puberty to secrete a lot of FSH. Do you know what FSH stands for? The follicle stimulating hormone and that is exactly what it's supposed to do. And the target organ is the ovary. And we're going to show you another diagram where you can see where the brain and where the ovary is situated far apart from one another. So with the blood the FSH travels to stimulate this process here, where the primary or the germinal epithelium cells become mature and the ovum must mature within this graphene follicle. Also, LH, a little bit of LH is also secreted and they are supposed to do this job. In um, Asun's cake, so FSR, FSH, follicle stimulerende hormone, in LH, beide van hulle word afgeskei. Meer FSA, en ons gaan net nog vele wijze grafiek, so dat kan sien, dat er meer FSA's LH afgeskei word, and they are supposed, or is responsible, to, um, for the egg cell to become mature.